Here, we'll go through an example of balancing a half reaction in acid solution. We're asked to balance the half reaction H2MOO4 gives MO in acid solution. We'll start by writing H2MOO4 on the left side and MO on the right side. We've left some room to add other things. We always start by balancing atoms other than oxygen or hydrogen. In this case, it is the element molybdenum, MO. There is one MO atom on both sides, so MO is already balanced. Our next step is to balance oxygen atoms. We see there are four oxygen atoms on the left and none on the right. Remember, for every excess oxygen atom on the left, we add one H2O molecule to the right. So we add four water molecules to the right side. Now we see there are four oxygen atoms on both sides, so oxygen is balanced. The next step is to balance hydrogen atoms. We see there are two hydrogen atoms on the left, and two times four are eight hydrogen atoms on the right. Because we have two H's on the left and eight H's on the right, we need six more H's on the left to balance hydrogens. Remember, for every H needed on the left, we add one H plus. So we add six H pluses to the left side. So now we have two plus six, which is equal to eight hydrogen atoms on the left side. And four times two, which equals eight hydrogen atoms on the right side. So hydrogens are balanced. The last step is to balance charges. On the left side, we have a total ionic charge of zero plus positive six, which is equal to positive six. Looking on the right side, MO and 4H2O both have a zero charge. So the total charge on the right side is zero. Remember, to balance charges, we add enough electrons to the more positive side to make the charges equal. Because the charge on the left is positive six and the charge on the right is zero, we must add six electrons to the left side. So we add six electrons to the left side. The total ionic charge on the left side is now zero plus six plus negative six, which equals zero. So the total ionic charge on each side is zero. Therefore, the charges are balanced. And the half reaction is balanced. At this point, you could pause the video and confirm to yourself that all atoms are balanced and the total ionic charge is balanced.